Hey guys, I want to show you something that's really, uh, really cool. I've been, you know, uh, if you've been following me, I've been using a Chromebook for to play Minecraft, especially for my kids. And the reason I choose Minecraft is because it's one of the cheapest laptop I can get. And I love the uh, the Chrome operating system because it's very light and you use very uh, small resources to uh, to run it. And uh, just yesterday, I. Um, uh, I went to Best Buy. I wanted to buy a more powerful laptop. Um, so one of the uh, the, the Best Buy, uh, of course, <coughs> people there recommend me the the Asus um, Q302 uh, laptop, which is about five hundred fifty dollars. So uh, it has like six gigabyte of RAM. The person said uh, it has to be more than four gigabyte. So I go ahead with uh, his recommendation, and so I got it. So. I, uh, I thought, you know, uh, it's uh, they have like a 15-day policy, so if I don't like it or it doesn't work uh, with uh, with playing Minecraft, and I can always return it. So I I installed the Minecraft on the Asus, the new Asus Q302, which using the Intel Core i3, the uh, I think the fourth generation, and using six gigabyte of RAM. So actually, this machine is more powerful hardware-wise than the. Uh, than the Chromebook that I have bought for my kids about uh, like last year or two years ago, which is the HP 14, this one, and the uh, Acer uh, C720. Uh, and I bought it, uh, if you've been following me, I bought it only ref the refurbished version, is only like less than $200, it's about $180. So this uh, Asus is about like two times or even more, almost three times more expensive than the. Uh, the Chromebook here, and and the reason I bought this uh, um, the ASUS because I wanted to not just to play Minecraft but also to record it uh, to play the Chromebook. No doubt about it. It's 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 very good. It's uh, it can get like 30 to um, even until like 40, 50, 60, sometimes 60 frames per second. But once I try to uh, record some stuff with it, it becomes like um, kind of lagging. So uh, that's the reason I want to buy the uh, the new laptop. So I installed the uh, the Minecraft on this uh, new uh, Asus uh, Q302, and then to my surprise, it's uh, it's less powerful when I play uh, using the uh, the Minecraft. You can uh, check it out on your own here. All right. So here is the uh, the Asus, and then this is the HP Chromebook, and this is the uh, the Acer uh, Chromebook too. So right now we are trying to uh, go to the uh, Mineplex, all right? Um, before we do this, I want to uh, uh, remind you that all of the settings uh, on the uh, Minecraft is the same. So I I put all the settings the same settings, so there is no um, difference, and we all lock into the same um, um, Wi-Fi. So right now I'm just trying to go to one of the server. Is we are going through the mine time server here. Okay, join server, and then here also join server. Yep, and then over here on the SS also join server. All right, and then I'm gonna just gonna click the F3 button, so you can see the uh, frame per second. So over here, as you can see, it's about 26, 29. Yeah, that's the ASUS. Over here is the HP Chromebook, it's about 48, 50 frames per second. Over here is another Chromebook, it's the Acer, it's about 49, you know, 47 frames per second. So, this is what I got. Uh, and it really surprised me because the, uh, I thought the Asus, which is, um, is newer, you know, it's like, uh, and it has a more powerful, I think, uh, Intel processor. And it has more, um, it has more uh, RAM too. The the Chromebook, the HP Chromebook, this one uh, is only four gigabyte, and also the Acer Chromebook also only four gigabyte, while the Asus has six. So right now, if you can see, it's still about you know 26, 23, you know. Sometimes it goes to 30. While here, over here, you can get like 60 frame per second. Over here, on another Chromebook, the Acer, 56, almost 60 frames per second, right? Over here, still, you can see, probably you can see uh, the reflection there. There you go. 
26.30. So I want to show you the setting. So um, a few of you guys are oh, probably the setting is different. You know, I'll just go to the options, go to the video settings here. I'm sorry, it's it's a bit um, it's very reflective here. So you can see the the graphics here. I set it up to fancy smooth lighting to minimum you know 3d analyx off clouds to fancy few bobbing off particle decrease render distance only to eight chunks maximum frame rate 60 frame per second mid-map level four all right so if you want to see the the hp chromebook if you go to the options too under video it's all the same setting so still fancy minimum you know eight chunks 60 frames per second brightness bright few bobbing off while on the acer too it is one second here go to the video settings all right still graphics fancy oops connection loss sorry let's go back again yeah this is the thing about the uh, the mindplex if it's uh, more than two minutes idle they will lock you off so let's go again to the options under video settings so here you go it's the same 8 chunks 60 frames per second view bobbing off brightness bright yeah graphics fancy smooth lighting minimum so i set it exactly the same lighting we are connected to the same wi-fi uh, but you can see here uh, yeah, 37 now 40 over here is about 40 50 yeah the hp 14 well, this one is the, uh, let's see, the Asus. Let's go back to game. You can see, 29. Now it's 59. Yeah, there's there's one in a while it goes to jump like to uh, 50, 60, but, and then right, right, it goes back right to uh, like 20. So, um, yeah, it's amazing. What do you, what, uh, what the Chromebook can do with just a small amount of money. It turns out um, It's at least it's more powerful than the uh, than the Asus Q302 and the price it's uh, twice uh, Or even sometimes three times the price now. I'm going to show you again What if I go to a different? Um, server I'll just disconnect and then I'll go to Let's say to uh, probably Mindplex. Let's go to Mindplex. All right. I'm going to Mindplex. All right. I'm going to Mindplex too here. All right. And then over here on the Asus, I'm going to Mindplex too. Uh, where is the Mindplex here? Here. All right. All right. So let's go in a little bit here. All right, let's turn on the uh, frame per second so you can see. So this is the uh, um, the Acer Chromebook, it's about 30, 34 frames per second. So it's slightly lower, uh, probably because the server is uh, it's bigger, so there's more people. So uh, it makes the uh, the frame per second also lower. That would be my guess. This is 27, so this is almost the same. Although it's slightly lower, so 26, 25. This is about 30, 32. This is about 30, 33, 35. Yeah, going back to the, again to the um, Asus. It's below 30 still, yeah? And then this one is also, it's about 30. And the uh, Acer is, uh, yeah, okay, 30. So it's almost the same, but again, um, this one is slightly lower still, although not as much. So it depends on the server. Now, now let's try to go to just to the um, uh, single player. So we're not going to the server, we're just going to the. Oops. Disconnect it first and then we'll just go to a single player. All right, single player here. Uh, I just select create new world, probably. 
Game mode survival? I don't know. Uh, game mode survival here. Okay, create new world. Okay, okay, this one also create new world. Game mode survival. This one create new world. Game mode survival. Alright, alright. So here we are already HP. So this is about 50 frames per second right away, alright? 50. How about this guy here? Um, this is still slow. I don't know, Bobby, there's a lot of uh, stuff inside it. That's why it's slower. How about this one? This one is about 40, 50 frames per second. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, now it's over here. It's all about, about 40 also, about 45. Yeah. Let's go. Woo! All right. This is about 450. This is the HP 14 Chromebook. And this is the Asus Chromebook. It's about 45, 60 sometimes. It's pretty good. Yeah. But this is uh, just playing on your own over here. There's nobody. Yeah. But still, it seems the, the Chromebook is still better. Look at this. It's almost 60. Well, this guy here, the Asus, is below 50, 40. And then let's go to the uh, Acer. Now it's 60. Yeah, let's go down. Whoa, whoa, 50, still 50, right? See the waterfall there? Let's go over here. Whoa, 150 here. This is uh, below, uh, below, yeah, below 50. Now it's 50. So, um, yeah, this is this is an amazing uh, discovery for me because I thought the like twice the price is almost sometimes three times the price um, of the, uh, the 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 Chromebook. I can uh, get a better frame per second. Apparently, no. Uh, apparently, the the Chromebook still in general. Uh, we we went to the two server, the Mindplex and the Mindtime, and on the uh, the 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 less crowded server, which is I think the the mine, uh, the mine tech, mine, mine time. I think the the difference is it's quite obvious. Uh, the the uh, the the Chromebook can go up until like 40, 50, while the Asus is only like 20, 30. You know, but when we go to the the more crowded server, the I think the Mindplex, there's still difference. It's, sometimes it's equal, uh, but still uh, the Asus still. Uh, uh, the frame per second is still lower, but 10% probably. And then on the on the single player, it's also still in general still lower, uh, or at least uh, equal. So uh, in uh, ASUS cannot beat the uh, the Chromebook. That's that's just my observation. So um, yeah, this is amazing, amazing value. It's only like a half of one third of the price of the uh, the ASUS and the Chromebook still wins for playing Minecraft. I'm just talking about Minecraft. I don't talk about any other games. So um, yeah, I just want to share this uh, with you. So I hope you uh, make a good decision. If you haven't got a Chromebook and you just want to want to play Minecraft, check out this amazing value from Chromebook, especially if you can get the refurbished, which I did, which is below like $200 refurbished version. Um, it's amazing. It's the, the 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 computer is very light, as you can you know. It's only like three pounds or less than three pounds. Yeah. Well, this one is a bit heavy. The HP 14. Yeah. Uh, well, this one, the Asus is uh, is a bit heavier. This is about I think like three three point six pound, and it comes of course with Windows, but. You know, I, I don't really need Windows. It's, I think it's just uh, overkill. There's many, uh, many of the applications that I don't need. Uh, Chromebook is just much more user-friendly and easier. And there's always a regular update. So uh, every like two weeks or every three weeks, there's a small icon on the right uh, bottom bar, which has an arrow 
and it will tell you if it needs update or not. You just have to click it and it will restart on its own and it will update. So, yeah, this is amazing for Chromebook and for playing Minecraft. Uh, so I do not know um, how much should I spend in order to beat Chromebook, you know, for to buy a laptop. And uh, probably I need to spend $500 more, which is like a thousand dollars laptop versus uh, $200 or $250 Chromebook. Probably it, will, it can beat the Chromebook in terms of the frame per second. Otherwise, uh, yeah, it, 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 it doesn't make sense for me. It's a no-brainer to choose a Chromebook. You know, not, not just, just to play Minecraft, but just in general application, just if you go, just want to go do browsing or go for YouTube and any other uh, uh, like light uh, 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 applications. Uh, um, with that, thank you for watching. See you next time.